Okay, so what is there in this question? A table tennis ball of mass 3 gram is fired with the speed of 10 meter per second from a stationary toy gun of mass 0 0.6 kg. The gun and the ball are an isolated system. What are the recoil speed of the toy gun and the total momentum of the system immediately after the gun is fired? Now this question is from the conservation of linear momentum topic and we know that for an isolated system the total momentum of the system never changes. Now before the ball was fired, before the gun was fired, we see that the ball is at rest and the gun is at rest. So what is the total momentum before firing the ball? The momentum is zero. So it means that the final momentum will also be zero even after the ball is fired. So our answer for the total momentum of the system should come out to be equal to zero because initially it was zero and now it is equal to zero. Now we are going to the second part of the question that is the recoil speed of the toy gun. So uh, what is the total momentum now? I will say m1 u1 plus m2 u2 and it will be equal to zero because initially the momentum of this momentum was zero. Now the mass of uh, we just substitute the values here and we make sure that all the units are from system international that is SI. So 3 kgs are uh, 3 gram into u1 and the velocity is given as 10 plus the mass of the gun is 0 0.6 kg and u2 we need to find equal to 0. So this will become u2 equal to minus 3 divided by 100 into 0 0.6. And it will become 0 0.5. So it is minus 0 0.05 meter per second. So our answer should be A. This is how we solve it. It's a very simple example where we have applied the principle of conservation of momentum on an isolated system. So this is how we do it. This is Professor Varun. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel and press the bell icon. All the best.